Ubisoft. I, this is the dumbest fucking tagline I've written, but you know what? I'm probably going to turn it into the podcast title. Ubisoft is going Ubi hard for Assassin's Creed, Mr. Black. That's... Look, I'm fucking calling this podcast Ubi hard. I'm almost positive. All right, do what you got to do. <laughs> Ubisoft is going in Ubi hard for Assassin's Creed. With the announcement uh, of Assassin's Creed Infinity. Did you see anything of this pop up on your timeline? No. Okay. God. So let me fucking just grace your uh, your brain with some of this information then. So Assassin's oh Creed Infinity. A live service platform for Assassin's Creed. Exactly what that, that series needed. Live service. Uh, games are all connected but look and feel different, which, in my opinion, is more or less what already is already happening. Already what it is. It's already right now. Okay. Uh, inspired by Fortnite and GTA Online, Mr. Black. Doesn't that inspire some confidence? Huh? Uh, I mean, they're bangers. Fortnite and, and GTA uh, Online, I mean, that, they're, that's some good shit. You know what that shit sounds like? It sounds like buzzwords. That's what that shit sounds like. It does, yeah. Fortnite, GTA Online, <laughs> Ubisoft, <laughs> Ubi Hard, Ubi Hard. Uh, both Quebec City and Montreal teams will be working on this instead of going back and forth. So traditionally, for the last several, you know, uh, go around for uh, Assassin's Creed, it would be the Quebec uh, Quebec team doing one, and then the next one would be you know Montreal, and they'd kind of like back and forth. Kind of similar to how Call of Duty has been run with a couple of studios. Uh, you know, in kind of a TikTok pattern. Uh, but they'll be working together uh, this time around. Uh, probably because I guess this is their what they called like their biggest project ever for this shit. And to be honest, the Assassin's Creed games, already pretty big fucking projects to begin with. Uh, I mean, they're, they're pretty massive games. And whoever the sorry fuck is that has to hide all the collectibles that they put in every one of these fucking games, uh, you're not getting paid enough money. Yeah. When you when you open a map in Assassin's Creed, if you aren't immediately stricken with enormous amounts of anxiety for how many map markers <laughs> appear, then you're a special kind of fucking person. Because like I'm, I mean, even as like a like a semi completionist like myself, I open that up and I immediately just say no, I don't want to play the game anymore because it's just too much. It's yeah. too much going on. So if this is going to be an even bigger fucking undertaking, I don't know what the fuck is going on here, but they're going to be pushing map markers to the outer limits of the of the human imagination, I'm sure, uh, when this rolls out. Now, uh, we have talked in the past how Ubisoft has had, uh, in the recent, uh, you know, not too uh, long ago, the sexual, you know, misconduct allegations levied uh, against several... And I mean several uh, Ubisoft employees, many of them kind of higher ranking individuals within the company. Uh, and uh, Ubisoft was asked about this because we haven't heard a hell of a lot about it. Uh, and then this major project's coming up and these, these people are still in their positions. So Ubisoft said that they were all investigated and appropriately dealt with. Uh, but some of those employees are maintaining their positions. So apparently the third party uh, investigation uh, either didn't find enough to have these people tossed to their positions, uh, or they were completely exonerated, uh, one way or the other. Um, they don't want to talk about it, obviously. Ubisoft will give the shortest possible answer every time, uh, for the fact that apparently half of their fucking, uh, executive board is, is sexually inappropriate at every turn. <laughs> so, there you go. If you care about that, there's your information. Uh, and then lastly with that, Apparently, more than a few employees have left the company due to this project, where internally people have been saying that a lot of employees have left because they were already burnt out from how big the projects for Assassin's Creed have gotten, and then the moment that they brought this down and said, this is the next project, and it was even bigger than everything that they'd ever already done before, and now they're combining both studios, uh, people said, you know what? I'm out. They said, no. They said, <laughs> they said, au revoir. Yeah, why? Well, that's there you go. Said. Au revoir. Uh -huh. Au revoir. Hard. So there you go. I don't know anyone that's excited about this. Even Assassin's Nobody Creed is. fans looking at it Dude, going. The developers aren't even excited about this. They left the damn fucking studio. Yeah. All right? Yeah. They don't want none of this. Yeah. 
right. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking weird. I don't like. I, I, yeah. Good luck, Ubisoft. Have fun with that one. Thank you.